We are making some brown butter raspberry chocolate chip cookies. Doesn't that sound so good? Raspberry and chocolate chip. They make 16 cookies, so hopefully they're good. We're first gonna brown 3 fourths cup of unsalted butter. In a large bowl, combine one cup of brown sugar. And then a fourth a cup, I always do a little less of regular granulated. Our brown butter. And now we're gonna whisk. I don't love recipes like this, but we're gonna add one egg and then one egg yolk. If I don't use my egg white, I think I just broke it. We're good, we're good. Oh, dang it. Oh, whatever. I just broke it severely. Uh, two teaspoons of vanilla extract. We're supposed to mix all of our dry ingredients separately in another bowl and then mix it in, which is 100% the way you're supposed to do it and you should do it. Am I gonna do it? Two cups of flour, three fourths teaspoon of baking soda, a half a teaspoon of salt. We'll just mix the dry ingredients right on top here. Okay. Fold it together just until there's no dry flour bits left. Do not over mix. You need a cup of chocolate chips and I'm gonna be fancy and cut up a chocolate bar. Perfect. Gently fold them in. These feel fancy. The recipe calls for half a cup of frozen raspberries. I only had fresh, so I popped these guys in the freezer for the duration of this recipe. And we'll see how messy it gets. Be very gentle. This makes 16 cookies. It's about two tablespoons per cookie. Bake for 11 minutes. I forgot to put finishing salt, so make sure you add that. The hardest part is waiting. It's scrumptious. And then we have our savory baking snack. 